What you doing? Got another one of those? You have good taste in beer. These are my favorite. So do you want to know how they make them? Sure. Well, they put the beans in the can pretty much as they are with various flavorings and whatnot. But they put the pork in there in one whole big piece. I know. How come when you get it, it's all broken up into little pieces, right? Well, after they put all the stuff in the can, they seal it up. And then they heat the pork and beans until it gets so hot that the pork explodes. It explodes? Yeah, it explodes right inside the can, which is why it's all broken up into little pieces and which is why they're all different sizes, which is what sparked my curiosity about it in the first place. I think it's good to be curious. One shouldn't just sit around and wonder about stuff. You should go out and find out what it's all about. Because otherwise you sit around just tortured by your curiosity and then you'll make up some twisted answer inside your head just to satisfy yourself and you'll never really know what the truth is it's torturous wondering how pork and beans are made tortured you well it didn't torture me but every time I opened up a can I wondered how they made it and now when I open up a can I feel at peace, because the question is no longer there. <laughs> From now on, every time I open up a can of pork and beans, I'm going to think of you. Well, that's sweet. Do I have something on my face? Yes. What? Pretty eyes? You're a cornball. <laughs> Sorry. I know, it's okay. I like it. I'm a cornball, too. Say something corny. My mother would like this face. She got a number? <laughs> about your problem and I figured I could help you out. It's just an old black and white but it gets pretty good reception. 